right, slicing up the pot pie, but we're not talking about chicken. Mike, what's going on? <laughs> no, indeed. Good morning, uh, Tammy. Yeah, Federal Finance Minister Bill Morneau will be meeting with his provincial counterparts today to talk about where the taxation money from the legalization of uh, marijuana set to start next summer is going to go and be divvied up. That $1 per gram, uh, you know, it's expected, or the initial proposal by the feds was a 50-50 split. The provinces have pushed back on that, saying, look, they're the ones who have to implement all the policing and the sale of uh, pot going forward, so they want a little bit more money. So that's something to watch for uh, from the federal and provincial finance side coming up today, talking about the legalization of marijuana. Start of Bitcoin futures trading today on the Chicago Board of Options Exchange. Lots of volatility on the cryptocurrency, but retail investors have a well, somewhat easier way now to buy in or invest in the uh, future, some say, of uh, how we're going to be buying and selling things in the immediate uh, reaction in the market, futures contracts up by as much as 26%. They had to actually put in trading curbs because the trading activity was so volatile, so extreme, and they're trying to calm things down just a little bit. Bitcoin this morning trading just below $17,000 U.S. And we have the markets coming into the trading week this morning at records again for Wall Street. The U.S. Uh, benchmarks all surged Friday on some very strong economic signals when it comes to job creation for the American economy. And on Wednesday of this week, we're expecting that U.S. interest rates are going to be going up once again. I'll send it back to the studio.